keep going uh i think this is kind of interesting and it just kind of opens up funeral portrait gets criticism for opening for marilyn manson i'm sorry my band <laughs> has consistently played 200 cap venues for seven years plus has a chance to open shows in front of thousands of people uh and you want to be upset by it if you truly know the people we are and you know the grind we've been on you wouldn't be mad Wow, so that that's that comes from uh, your old fun. portrait, yeah. And uh, yeah, this uh, Marilyn Manson tour, I mean, he's back with all after all the sexual allegations and this and that. Uh, and these th- th- it looks like the tour is selling well, uh, but now people who are involved with it are getting flack. I mean, not super surprising. I gosh. I don't know. I that's a hard one. Like I, it, the things that the allegations against Manson are pretty fucking real, and like it's not great to, you know, treat women the way that he allegedly has. Um, so like I don't blame people Agreed. for not wanting to support him. Like I, you know, I. There, I think there's cases where you can separate the art from the artist. So it's like, you know, like if I have like a Marilyn Manson song come up on like shuffle or something, I'm not like, oh my God, I have to turn this off. And, you know, but like there are, it, you can, you can kind of like it, people who feel that way. Like, I think that's valid to not want to listen to somebody or like give them your support or time or money. Um, uh, I don't think like going after the opening band though is like, super cool because like yeah if, if it's your opportunity and you're like hey i just want to you know bring my show out to people like it does seem a little like cruddy that your like big break is like sort of on the heels of a, a washed up controversial guy dude. <laughs> <full assault>. yeah. <laughs> yeah like that does yeah, it does sound like uh like one of those you get your genie in a bottle wish and you're <laughs> and they're like, you know what, you're gonna have a you're gonna be playing a monkey, some uh, a stadium. Monkey, yeah. Right. A monkey's paw wish, you you get what you want, but yeah, like you, a, a terrible want, cost. <laughs> yeah, like all their girlfriends break up with them in the band and they're just like we're doing it. Yeah. Yay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but, no. it's unfortunate. I, you know, speaking speaking of which, I mean like you know, separating the art from the artist, like you know, again, every every artist, especially like big rock stars from back in the day before Me Too movement, were not good people. <laughs> oh, dude! I and I think like it, at the end of the day, everyone kind of just has to like draw. There's no there's no like real rule to it. I mean, like some people it's like yeah, absolutely not. But then there's other ones where you're like shit. Like I really like Led Zeppelin. Like yeah Should or i mean ozzy osborne no. ozzy osborne is another one uh and he's getting into the the rock and roll hall of fame which we were going to talk about at some point but yeah i think that's that's interesting wait what did ozzy do i don't know I've, I've heard i've heard that yeah he people have been yeah and honestly i'm not going to just start throwing out allegations but uh i've heard in the past that he's done some shit and i've never checked because i didn't really want to <laughs> Uh, yeah that's <laughs> although he's been with sharon for like ever so and he I... does... yeah he does seem self-aware so i don't know oh yeah 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 that's i i guess i'd say is like you know don't don't hate on the opening band for taking an opportunity like good for them for getting out there and like hey like you know people who are going to the show like somebody you know needs to get, open the show like you know yeah i don't I, as much as like maybe like manson's not my taste anymore and i wouldn't want to support him like i also don't think that like there there are not st- a ton of crimes that i think are so bad that somebody should never have a chance to like be an artist again so like even if he's like not for me like i'm guess like there are obviously people who are excited to see manson in the band and i that yep. good for those people and i'm good for him for i i don't think anyone's like a shouldn't have a chance at redemption so like yeah i i think that, that is a big thing with our culture is like i think we're kind of getting past that a little bit i think people are giving chances at redemption if people do seem fine 
I don't know. Uh, I mean, I think but, but what was the bummer about Mar- Marilyn Manson was like he was he was the dude that was like talking to like Bill O'Reilly on the news and he just looked crazy, but he was more articulate and and thoughtful about like why why people don't like me or whatever. He was he was that was interesting, and that I think really bummed a lot of people out. Was like this guy was you know kind of seemed like he had his shit together and he was just kind of a piece of shit and uh, yeah, he you know. was he i think he was the one who he was talking about like the columbine shooters and they were like if you could say anything to them what would you say and he's like i would have wanted to listen to them because like they are obviously like hurt and like uh, you know did a really terrible thing because they were like hurt damaged people and i was like yeah that's honestly like a really good way to approach it like um it's possible to be a really smart insightful person and also be an asshole like you can you can kind of be both shoot to be the good one but uh yeah yep on to the next